So, hi, how are you? Oh, hi, thank you, I'm doing fine. So, I see you have a YouTube channel. How long have you been doing YouTube? I'd say about 30 days. Yeah, I've been doing, making videos on YouTube for about 30 days. Give or take, a day, a day or so. Yeah, I started back in August 8, mm -hmm. 2020. Yeah, this the year. Awesome year. I see, I see, I see. Hello, you, you beautiful you josh b castro here with another video by the way i upload my videos every sunday and wednesday of the week uh on sundays i upload at 8 a.m in the morning and on wednesdays i upload at 8 p.m in the evening pdd time that's specific daylight time because it's daylight savings time right now it's gonna change depending on yes so yeah but anyway now uh, this is basically an update video so in this video i'm gonna be talking about my first 30 days since starting a youtube channel in 2020 uh what i've done what i've been through what i've experienced my growth on this platform called youtube all of it and you know my future plans what i'm about what i want to do and everything under the sun that I can possibly think of. Before anything else, I want to thank Roberto Blake uh, and Sean Cannell from Think Media. Uh, the, these two influencers, uh, these two video, these two YouTubers have really influenced me. That's what, I, yeah, a lot. Um, I've really consumed a lot of their content and then applied it in my YouTube journey. So if you guys want to check these two guys out uh, in, you know, see what they have got to they, they could probably help you with something i most likely they will so that you can just i'll leave their channels in the link i'll leave the link to their channels in the description box below so you can check them out make sure i put those there also i would like to thank my current subscribers we're gonna go in detail on that but i now i have three i actually have three uh the first one's my girlfriend but Apparently she's not seen here. I don't know why so we'll figure that out uh, In a future video, I guess and I'd also like to thank my family. They have been such an Awesome support. They don't know that I have a channel yet. Uh, so if you're watching this right now, then now, you know uh, Because I've been doing this 30-day experiment where I don't share Don't market my channel for the first 30 days of starting my channel that's gonna be a for a future video probably in another 30 days or so we're gonna see where that goes from here but yeah thank you so much for the support and your future support it's gonna it's really much appreciated thank you thank you a thousand times thank you all right so let's first start when we why when i started youtube i started my youtube channel back in august 8 2020 i started it then because of numbers I, I i did explain this in my very first video because you know august is eight and then eight and the 2020 so there's like repeating numbers and then there's there's a thing about eight because it's a complete you know infinity kind of thing going on so it's like a lucky number so yeah i started my channel then because of that very reason and then the fact that it's 2020 it just makes perfect sense so yeah but why youtube why did i start youtube what is my what is my what is my goal here what do i want uh basically you know the 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 right answer would probably be to say you know i want to help people grow i want to be uh, a light to those who are in the dark something like that but uh, honestly, it's probably along the lines of money because <laughs> yeah, uh, it's not that's not a bad thing to say right? Don't be ashamed that you know money is your motive to create a YouTube channel by all means create a YouTube channel because you want to get rich uh, But it's not it's not gonna be an easy process uh, It's not gonna it's gonna be hard There are other easier ways to make money uh, aside from YouTube YouTube is probably one of the hardest ones to actually do unless you got it right or you're lucky or there's lots of other reasons how it can be easy too but you know for me in this day and age that we're living right now uh you've already developed this mindset this idea all right especially now that's 2020 and everyone's living at home in this this year in this decade uh 
that you know you can make money from doing the things you love you do doing the things you're passionate about doing the things that you're good at and you enjoy and then you make money off of that that's just a really good concept that's a really good idea i'm like i i buy that i'm sold i want that so i'm, I'm starting my youtube channel another reason why that's not a good thing because you know if you can earn from doing youtube right and you're doing something you love at the same time helping bringing value to the audience to you guys to you beautiful people then then there's nothing wrong with that right uh, i i get paid and i can improve upon the things i do that bring you value upping my quality upping my production value while not having to worry about the, the you know the roof under my head Uh, clothes food you know all the ba basic needs are that people actually need to get met you know not having to worry about that doing something you love bringing value or well, earning you know which is not a bad thing because you know then yeah it's it's a win-win if i do say so myself but then again this this journey this youtube journey right here it's not it's not gonna be easy all right i've already come to terms with that all right i've been on youtube for 30 days on this channel And yeah, it's it's definitely hard. It's but it's it's challenging. And then you know, with life, it just has to be challenging. Because if it's boring, then what's the what's the point? Yeah. So anyway, enough of that. I'll probably expound upon this certain topic that I've brought up in a different video, most likely in my Project Nine Minute Video uh, series that I'm gonna be doing soon. Actually, I'm already currently doing it, but I, I have something in the plans of that long the lines. So just wait till the third Wednesday of this month. So this is my channel right here, as you can see. My beautiful channel with no vanity link yet. I'm working on that. Uh, I think it's when you hit 100 subs. So yeah, we got my banner right here. Yeah, this picture is really... Yeah, I, I only spent an hour. I'm gonna remake this. This is not the final. I'm like, I have, it looks like I have scoliosis in this picture, which... I, I get what I was going for, but yeah, and then these are black bars, I know, I can fix that, I just got lazy and, you know, they didn't have the time to, but yeah, I'll, I'll work on that, and yeah, so, me, moving on to my name, so yeah, for those of you who don't know why, I'm, I, I decided to brand myself as Josh V. Castro without spaces, just, you know, like one word, is because... Uh, my name is Josh Castro, and then V is also part of my name. If you guys know what V means, then you're one of the one of the people that are in the in. You know, you're the in people anyway. So, uh, with brand building, you want to have consistency with all your social media domains, and this username is actually apparently available because Josh Castro there's a lot of Josh Castros in the world and if I go by that if I build my brand around that and then people search for me it's gonna be hard for, for them to search for me so I, I recommend you do the same make sure that if you brand yourself brand yourself in a way that's unique it's uh, searchable and you know you, you, it's consistent and it's available on most social media platforms or if not all <laughs> ideally so yeah and then i like the concept you know small small j small c then there's this big letter v in the middle like a like a bush just like it's like an arrow down it's like josh castro and then there, the v just comes in and, and then yeah that's that's what's going on in my i'll make a really cool intro video Uh, and add those in my it's it's in the it's a plan but it's like an intro where the, there's my animation of my brand name i'm gonna do that all right soon sometime maybe next month we'll see so yeah that's that's my name in a nutshell uh so i have three subscribers all right so thank you so much for subscribing all right like i said a while ago all right i really appreciate you Uh, and you know to the future subscribers or if you're already subscribed or if you did subscribe thank you again you are awesome and you know who you are so here are my videos as you can see I have nine videos this is the 10th video so I have nine videos right now I started a month ago uh, on August 8 
it specifically. I uploaded two videos a week, uh, every Sunday and every Wednesday. I already said that in the start of this video. And yeah, so these are my videos. I'm like, the thumbnails are all over the place. And that was not the initial plan. I just did not have time to build my brand image yet. There is no brand image going on here. It's everywhere. There's no consistent color theme. There's no consistent shape theme. There's no consistent anything. Um, I'm like, there's probably my taste on how I edit videos or how I edit thumbnails. That's probably shown there. I'm like, you can probably tell what with the fonts I use. So there's some sort of consistency, but it doesn't shout my brand yet for me. This is just, this is a me thing. I'm like, probably for for you maybe to a certain extent because you see my face in in seven of these videos except these last two because I, I was having a hard time it just made more sense it was more relevant to make the this because I was doing it about my brio um, that just made more sense to just make these the thumbnail and they turned out fine if I do say so myself uh, this one is really really blue uh, I don't know what happened here. Uh, this one actually, this is a nice shot of me. I like the lighting on this one. Uh, and the color tone as well. This one was not as good. And then why? Why? Why did it, why did it just choose this white? It's really plain, but it worked. So I'm keeping that. As you can see, my most viewed video is the one on this OBS studio. I, it's, it's a good video. I'm like... When I did my keyword research on this, there wasn't a lot of YouTubers making content around how to stop recording automatically on OBS Studio. So I did that upon myself and made it. And then I don't know how it turned out to be 30 minutes long, but it did. And then this one was 40 minutes long. How to use OBS Studio for beginners. It's like a freaking masterclass. Uh, yeah. yeah, and then this one's on Zoom. And then I did, re you know... Uh, did a rework kit on Kurokasu, uh, which was cool, which was fun. And then this is the this is the final. You're you're seeing the final product of this video right now. Uh, I'm actually gonna do a video about that soon. Uh, probably next video or the next next video. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, this one is Project Nine Minute Video. This is the project that I started to, pre you know, to master my on camera presence skill. I want to be an expert on being. In the camera and then you know how I how my performance is portrayed to you guys so that's what this yeah this project that I started is all about and yeah to buddy cuz you know I, I'm I'm dipping myself I'm dipping uh, I'm starting affiliate marketing I want to do affiliate marketing I'll expound about that later and then that's to buddy and then it's also a good tool for to YouTube for YouTube so that's why I chose you, buddy. Uh, for what is it? VidIQ? Uh, probably try that soon. Probably in six months. So I can do actually a good comparison video between VidIQ and you, buddy. It's a one year project. So we'll see how that pans out. In a year. In a year. Yeah, so moving forward, I wanna. Yeah, so on the videos I wanna create, I have a list of videos I wanna create. But it's more of on the along the lines of technical stuff so i still want to expound on i'm still finding my niche but I, all i know is i want to be a creative entrepreneur so i want to help you guys make money while doing the stuff you enjoy just like roberto blake or sean cannell uh, but right now it's centered on how to create your youtube channel because youtube is one form of revenue that you can add to your or one form of uh stream of income you can add to your stream of incomes hopefully you have more than one aside from your five to nine job yeah so that's yeah i'm still i'm still finding myself but you know so far i've made some videos that are hopefully of value so that at, at the end of the day i just want to provide value and if i can do that with with the things that i want you know if there's a video that i wish i could see if i could actually make that then that's perfect all right that's that's where we're going okay that is what we're gonna be doing mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. cool all right so like i said a while ago i used tubebuddy i all right, i've been using tubebuddy since the start of my youtube journey i like on, on day one on august 8 i used to like for instance if you if you search kuro kesu 
Alright, Brio. Uh, my video should show up here because, yeah, it's it's. I really optimized this video really well so that it will show up on the first. I don't know if it's gonna show up on you, but yeah. So here's True Buddy Search Explorer. This is what I use to search for keywords. So like Kurokasu, uh, Logitech, Brio. You can actually see a number uh, there. So yeah, it, it takes a while for it to load, but then see 45 so the higher the number the better it is you can see in search volume and competition so this is what i've been using to you know search for titles and keywords and etc uh, tubebuddy has a lot of features i did make a video about that so you can check that out uh here or links in the description also if you want to sign up for tubebuddy yourself you can use my affiliate link it will do, it will support and help the channel uh, that will be here you can you know also in the link in the description everything is in the description in my beautiful description box so check those out so yeah that's one tool I've been using uh, as for hardware as you know I'm using a Logitech Brio uh, 4k webcam which is which I reworked with the Kuro Castle enclosure this video right here so I for, as for my PC I built it myself it has a GTX 1070 Ti, 16 gig of RAM. That, that's not honestly a lot of RAM anymore, uh, especially with today's standards. So I really want to upgrade that if ever I have the opportunity to upgrade that. RAM is that cheap too, especially mine, because mines were have high clock speeds, uh, speeds to get in the four three eights, 2800. It's fast, and it's hard to find two of, so I can have like a four. Yeah. Anyway, uh, I have a i7. 8700k it's coffee lake uh, it's inside there. it can be overclocked have not overclocked it yet but i will soon and <laughs> all right so yeah where were we uh yeah so let's move on to my microphone so i use a audio technica atr 2100 usb microphone you can see it right here so it's this guy right here that's my microphone i've been using that since day one as well it's a good microphone it's not the best but it's it, it was affordable at the time and i have it set up up here honestly you should have it actually closer to your mouth because this is it picks up everything but if it's closer the quality is better but you know i did up the gain in uh in the software obs so it should pick up my voice and should be loud enough for you to hear so yeah that's that uh i have these headphones that I don't use anymore because there's a problem with the on yeah the audio just disappears so I default to these now uh, these are yeah they, they're just basically uh, hi hi-fi hi-fi earbuds so that and then yeah that's pretty much my the, the gist of my setup that works I'm like if ever there's something I'd want to upgrade probably the camera actually the camera is fine we'll see depends on you know i'm like yeah i i i would want to upgrade my camera to a dslr that would be really cool that that's the that's the that's the goal uh but i don't know if that's the immediate goal probably a graphics card because with the 3070s out that actually is compelling but i think i need ram first and storage storage is also an important thing i'm really low on storage right now this is like i have a five terabyte and then it's almost full but it's yes yeah, either that or that you know there, there's a lot of things you'd want to upgrade you know being a youtuber is expensive i i, I also have this soft box here i i probably want to get another one here but you know so far this works you can see me i'm lit and then it's it's not the ceiling light so yeah we should be good we should be fine Th this should be still beautiful all right, so that that's basically what th these are the tools that I'm using to create this YouTube vi video to, to, cre to create my videos on YouTube. So yeah, this is probably what you've all been waiting for my analytics. So what does being on YouTube for 30 days look like? So here we go. In a nutshell, I have gained over 96 views, 5.1. Uh, hours of watch time and i have two plus two subscribers in the last 28 days all right let's do lifetime plus three subscribers 
in the last 30 days so that is beautiful uh, so this is lifetime as you can see here my lifetime is 30 days 31 days 31 32 days give or take give or take i started august 8 right now it's september 9 as of this recording and as of uploading it should still be september 9 okay so impressions uh i have 748 impressions remember guys i want to be as transparent as possible and impressions click through rate is seven percent this was it's actually going down this was actually better at some point can i refresh and see if it went up nope uh okay so yeah 98 views and unique viewers uh, i have 48 unique viewers so thank you everyone who actually viewed and watched even one second of my videos thank you so much so as for engagement we have the same 5.3 hours so this is my average view duration three minutes and 15 seconds so i i'm i'm able to capture someone for about three minutes that's not bad uh, that's 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 better than nothing you know i am still starting so these are probably all within expectations or i'm, I'm probably even doing really good <laughs> i don't know uh, this is my first analytics video so this is my trend as you can see it's going up uh from unique viewers average views per person for view per viewer so it's it's up and down i'm like i guess that's normal except for here it's actually plateaued and i have three subscribers my first subscriber which is my girlfriend that subscribed on the day i probably no on the on on the ninth yeah the day after i started my channel and then i just you know had no no subscribers for the next second third fourth fifth sixth seventh video and then i had another subscriber and then eighth and then boom i had my third subscriber on september 3 so yeah that's my subscriber growth so that's basically it there's really not much to see here uh you know per per video you already saw that my highest uh ranked video right now is my obs studio how to stop recording automatically 2020 followed by the kurokeso unboxing video which actually did well i don't know if most of these views are from me because because i tend to watch my videos again uh then my least working video is tubebuddy uh, tubebuddy is actually kind of saturated right now to be honest but i'm trying to get my yeah i'm trying to get my my yeah mine out there so uh we'll, we'll see how that works out i'm starting my youtube channel it actually did fairly well for my first video so that's cool so reach i'm honestly waiting for audience i want to see from what countries are you guys from that would be cool so i'm waiting for that there's still not enough geography data geographic data to show this report as well for asian gender uh subtitles yeah i i wanted to do that that was a plan but then when i tried to do it captioning my own videos from scratch is is a lot of work it's a lot of work i want to do it i can probably pay someone to do it but i can't right now because but i would i'd pay someone to do that for me captioning my own videos that would be really wonderful because i don't i don't want to do that no no not me um so yeah uh when your viewers are on youtube we don't have that uh, let's see other stuff engagement yeah top video top videos by end screen okay but they're all zero top playlist project nine minute video okay i guess because that's probably one of the playlists that i'm actually pushing uh for reach let's see yeah traffic 35.7 percent youtube search channel pages 33.7 percent so that's basically one third of everything browse feature 12.2 percent external 11.2 percent director unknown 4.1 and then others 3.0 percent uh impressions and how they lead to watch time all right cool we have a seven percent click through weight views per impression then watch time from impressions 2.8 okay cool cool that's that's cool uh traffic source bing <laughs> I'm, 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 people are searching me on Bing. Okay, and then 9% 9, 9 on Google. That's interesting. Proportion of your total traffic. Traffic source by suggested video. Well, 100% from this, okay. 
uh, traffic source on YouTube. Search Brio Logitech, Brio 4K. Had to start my YouTube channel, Logitech Brio. OBS Studio Tutorial 2020. Alright. All right. So, yeah. So, these are my channel analytics. Hopefully, this is... Yeah, this is what you'd expect, I think. I don't know. Please tell me. Uh, I'm still only 30 days on YouTube. So, if this is good or bad or normal or underperforming, overperforming for a channel that did not market itself for 30 days, just solely YouTube, right? I did not, I did not share my videos on Facebook, on Reddit, on Twitter, on Instagram, to my friends, to my family. Did not do that for 30 days. Hopefully, this, yeah, this makes sense. <laughs> right, but now that the 30 days are over, Here's my Instagram channel. Channel. Here's my Instagram. Uh, so yeah, now that 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 yeah that but the thirty days are over. I'm gonna actually start marketing myself properly, sharing myself properly. Gonna you know I'm gonna share this with my family, my friends, and everyone that I can think of, and other social media platforms where I can actually extend my reach. Even though I still don't have an audience there to that I haven't built. But let's see where that goes. So yeah, so this is my Instagram. Uh, here's my handle, Josh B. Castro. So if you go and follow me on Instagram, you can do so right now. Uh, here's my Facebook page. Yeah, it's it's nothing yet. Um, this was from when I was traveling back. Uh, and, uh, you had to wear a mask. It wasn't it wasn't as strict back then. I'm probably gonna change that so we can be brand consistent. I don't know how I'm gonna go about that. This. Cover page was so that I have a cover page. So this is Shiro from No Game No Life on a chessboard, and yeah, that's pretty much all that is here. Uh, and then everything else I have to work on. Uh, sadly, I did not get Josh Vikasho. I don't know why it's not available. It's it's not existent, but it's not available as well. So I had to stick with that FB, which is fine. <laughs> you know, no need to be nitpicky, but yeah, it would be cool if you could get everything. But I didn't. So you have to compromise and it's okay. Uh, so here's my Twitter. I don't know how to use Twitter yet. Uh, I know you just use Twitter. But I don't know how to use it properly. So you know like I said. If you want to build something. Focus on two. At least two channels. Uh, YouTube. Facebook. Or YouTube. Instagram. Don't do them all. But it's good to have them. It's, it's still good to have them. So I have a Twitter. So if you want to follow me on Twitter. You can do so at Josh B. Castro. So yeah, that I, I at least got that. Alright, I also just met a subreddit. Today I'll make a video on how to make a subreddit in the future. It's really straightforward and simple. Hopefully I can make that. So yeah, I have a subreddit now. See, created today, September 9, 2020. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing I'm just gonna, just like with Facebook, I'm just gonna repost my videos here. I'm like, All right, I made this video. You can watch it here. Uh, same with Reddit. So that's my plan for those. So that way, you know, I'm I'm in different places where people can find me. I I I'd recommend you do the same. So here's my Fiverr account. Uh, so yeah, I still, I also got it, Josh B. Castro. So why am I showing you Fiverr? Because I I have plans to start freelancing, and then what better place to start than Fiverr? There's other platforms as well. I'll do future videos on those in the future. But right now, I want to get my hands wet, uh, my feet wet in Fiverr and start my freelancing career. I want to see how it goes from here. Uh, you know, you can earn five bucks, I heard. That's why it's called Fiverr. Uh, so that's why I'm starting this freelance journey. And I also want to share it on my YouTube channel. So it's a win-win, you know. I want to show people that you can make money from doing things that you're skilled at. And then how to do it yourself right? how to optimize your channel I'm like it's clearly I, I, I made this account in May but I haven't done anything I just wanted to make sure I got my my username and I did so that's cool also I want to delve into affiliate marketing all right really kudos to Roberto Blake all right he loves affiliate marketing and then he's a two buddy affiliate uh, master or legend or He's up there. He's really well known. And this is my True Buddy. If you guys want to use my True Buddy affiliate link, True Buddy is a really cool, cool tool for keyword search for, for YouTube optimization. It's really awesome. 
uh, I recommend you do it if you want to use it if you if you want to make an account it's free you can use my link chewbuddy.com for such as Castro I made a video about that you can check that out somewhere up here uh, or in the in the links it's all everything is in the description box so please please check that out uh, so yeah th there's an affiliate marketing program for true buddy i'm also delving into bluehost bluehost because i do plan to make a website i already purchased the domain uh, my domain is gonna be joshvcastro.com uh, i also have an affiliate link so if you want to if you plan to buy a domain you can support the channel and use my affiliate link it's this bluehost.com forward slash track for slash josh castro everything's in the description as well and then here's torgar torgar is a vpn uh, uh, that's a really good vpn i've been using this vpn for quite some time now uh, especially with netflix youtube and it's really cool uh, they have wireguard now which they just introduced recently and i don't have an affiliate link yet but hopefully it's gonna be josh Castro. so if i ever i do have one it's gonna be in the description not right now and also Amazon affiliate program. I do want to be affiliate with Amazon. I actually did try to apply for them once, but then I wasn't able to get any sales because I started wrong. So hopefully this time around with a website, I have lots of plans and I will share these plans and my journey doing these affiliate programs on my YouTube channel. I will make videos on those so you can watch out for those. So yeah, if this, is a, this is an interesting project that I have, you know. I, I probably might even make a whole new channel just specifically for Amazon products and showcasing you know stuff so that that's gonna be something to look forward to so yeah that is is basically everything uh, that I, I plan to offer you as a, a brand because you know I'm a personal brand I'm building my own personal it's my name so it's a personal brand it's, it's a, and then I want to make this into a business that's the goal and with everything yeah so at the end of the day i just want to say thank you again for you know supporting the channel for watching my videos but hopefully you did find value and then you can thank me because you know that that would just be really awesome to be thanked for because i actually did my part which it which is my goal but at the same time i do want to thank you for the support because you know everything helps everything does help Alright, so let's see, yeah, so, so let's see how far we can go, let's see how far I can go, and good luck to all of you who are also starting your YouTube career, your YouTube journey, your creative entrepreneurship, yeah, that's, that's it, alright, let's call it a day, alright, so for more channel update videos, you can watch this playlist over here, and you can watch these videos somewhere, uh, thank you and see ya